All right, so we're about to jump in, kick off our warp gates, and we're gonna start by kicking off a warp gate. It's the Vance Prep warp gate. You've already installed it. It's just to create our sacred space to help like tell the energy first to clear ourselves, but also tell the energy where we want to go because we're releasing so much of it. And we want our day to be like as calm and peaceful as possible, even though we're doing a ton, a ton of energy work. So it's very simple. It's just advanced prep warp gate, activate in my highest good. <sighs> All right, so we've kicked off our protective area. We've got our sacred bubble. This is for if you're an only child, we've got a special self-referencing chain for you. It's very simple. It's all of the self-referencing energetic chains I have to myself. Is it safe to feel worthy being the only one I release in my highest good? Just taking that moment to feel in the body, feel the energy moving, and then let it go into your unconscious and really go deep. We're gonna do the knot version. So it's all of the self-referencing energetic chains I have to myself. Is it not safe to feel worthy being the only one I release in my highest good? Awesome, so now you've kicked off your warp gate. We're just gonna tell the energy where to go because your unconscious mind is gonna be doing a ton, a ton, a ton of energy work. And we just wanna make that kind of dissipate as easily as possible. So your conscious mind, your conscious day goes as easy as it can while you're doing a ton of energy work. And it's very simple. It's the advanced prep warp gate. Once again, so we say advanced prep warp gate, activate in my highest good. <sighs> Awesome. You are done for the day. You've kicked off your warp gates. They're going to be running in your unconscious mind. And like I like to say, until we talk again, have a blessed day or a blessed night.